What's up everyone? Drew Snipes here with Beers and Gears. And on today's episode, we're going to do a review and demo. Yes, a review and demo of this Crate GX130C. I'm super excited about this one. I love this amplifier. Uh, if you've watched my channel for over the past month, month and a half, you've seen my reviews of the Crate G600XL and the Crate GX900H, which are both really awesome amplifiers, but all overshadowed by this thing. This thing is absolutely awesome. Uh, definitely gets you that crunchy death metal sound um, used by Cannibal Corpse on the Bleeding album. Um, used live by Cannibal Corpse for a couple years before the Bleeding and after the Bleeding. Uh, before ultimately switching to their Mesa Boogies, which they play today. So, definitely uh, a power amplifier. Definitely a great distortion sound to it. So, let's get into how this thing sounds. Alright, so we're all hooked up, ready to go. We're going to use the signal chain of this ESP LTD Joker 7 string going into the crate, into the Sheffield loaded PV cab behind me, and the RG8 to the right of the camera. Just for fun to start with the clean channel. I know that's not why you guys are here for this thing, but pretty cool, right? Clean channel. So with the clean channel, you get your three band EQ, high, mid, lows. There's also a gain knob on here, and there's a level knob as well. So turn that gain down to nine o'clock. Clean it all up a little bit. Add a level. Let's turn highs and mids up to two. Turn bass down to 11. Don't really like a lot of bass on my clean. So, pretty cool solid state clean. Nothing too exciting. Uh, simple and easy. Um, but with this GX130 is also the chorus channels which, you know, are not really using it for the uh, drive channel, but we'll, we'll get a little secret in this amplifier later on. So let's turn this thing on. This is chorus. great chorus but it's usable I guess uh, turn them all the way back down again there's also a bright switch on the clean channel which doesn't really do much so very subtle uh, so uh, leave it out just don't know what it's doing but that's not why we're here, right? Let's switch over to that gain channel and see what we can get. Gain channel, you have yourself your level control, your gain control, also your highs and lows, and then in the middle is a shape, which is um, kind of like a mid mid control, but it works backwards. If you want more mid, you put your shape down. If you want no mid, you put your shape all the way up. So we're going to start with everything at 12 o'clock. This is gain channel. <laughs> shape knob down. Let's add some mid push in there. Just to show 
show you the shape. Let's turn it all the way up. I hear the other end of the spectrum. <laughs> grittiness that you're looking for uh, with this amplifier so <clears throat> turn that back down to where it was <clears throat> Now here comes my little thing that I've noticed is that um, using the chorus on the distortion you're not really getting much it's not doesn't really sound that great but having the chorus knob all the way off but then engage it adds a little bit of life to it uh, which is really good <laughs> It's a little bit more adds a little bit more tightness to it for some reason it's, it's kind of weird how how it works um you know it's just a bypass chorus knob basically add it all the way down both channels uh but it kind of adds a little bit more something to it a little bit more life i really enjoy it i really like how it sounds with a chorus knob on <laughs> you say this is the crate gx 130c this is the classic death metal amplifier giving you the classic death metal sound um awesome everything i, I hoped it would be um kind of takes the g600 xl to the next level uh definitely sounds a whole lot better than the gx 900h uh crate knew what they were doing this thing is awesome absolutely awesome um and it's kind of crazy. I found it on musiciansfriend.com. I mean, scope, scope their use section. You, you can always find great stuff every now and then on that site. Um, and it's always dirt cheap. Like you find these on eBay and Reverb for $700,000, $900,000, crazy numbers. I found this on Musician's Friend, 279 used. 279 This is the amplifier for $279. What a deal. I scroll the musician's friend use section at least once a day, twice a day, and just see if something pops up. Who knows? You never know what you can find. Um, I guess the next thing I'm looking for would be the Marshall 8100. Keep searching for that thing. So, that's it for today's video. I've been Drew Snipes of Beers and Gears. This is the Crate GX 130C. Please like, share, and subscribe for future content. I'm putting out videos every Tuesday at 6 30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Man, oh man, is this thing awesome. Great, GX-130C. Drew Snipes, I'll see you in the next one. Yeah.